All right, guys, it is a cloudy, windy, and cool day here in the end times in paradise. Thursday, April 15, 2021. So we are continuing our vain pursuit to find a bird in the Okefenokee Swamp. We have now driven, coming in from the east side of the swamp, driving for 10 miles, hiking in for about a mile, going up a four-story tower, looking over this, probably a, one of the, do you have to put a quarter or is it free? Oh, it's free, okay. The telescope is actually free. So anyway, here we are in a birder's paradise, looking out over this marshy wetland, in the middle of the Okefenokee Swamp. All right, guys. Explain it to me. There is not one, not one water bird in sight. I guess they could be hidden, but I mean the egrets, uh, anything that's white or pink or anything, but uh, this thing should just be crawling with all sorts of water birds. There is not one bird in sight. I haven't used the telescope yet. From here, I'm not seeing one alligator. I don't see one alligator head poking up. There is a big old wasp, though, building a nest in the telescope. Uh, I'm determined to see one sign of a bird in the Okefenokee Swamp. Uh, this is 500,000 acres. Uh, you cannot blame this on hunting. You cannot blame this on habitat destruction. And the, I don't even think you can blame this on pollution. Really. You can't blame it on phosphate mining. Uh, can't blame it on uranium mining. Uh, we are in one of the biggest stretches of wilderness. And this is some of the cleanest water. Talking to the old man who's lived here his whole life, 90, 91 years old and uh, more energy than I've got. And he was chalking it up. He says, eat wild animals. And he said, this is some of the cleanest water left in the United States. You can't blame this on pollution, habitat destruction, or hunting. So what do you blame it on? I've been coming to this tower for how many years? This should be you know, one of the great bird watching spots. But uh, there you go. We are chronicling the collapse of the Okefenokee Swamp and the rest of the planet. Totally weird. Get out there and enjoy the Okefenokee Swamp before the plants follow the animals into oblivion. Haven't seen an alligator since we got out of that truck today. Have to go back to Crazy Crane Campground so I can see some damn birds in my own backyard. Oh my gosh.